Hi everyone, welcome back to the gang. You know the vibes. Hi, my name is Lebu Gang. <laughs> but it makes sense. Lebu Gang to begin. Okay, 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 okay. Back to the gang with your girl label gang if you're here for the first time thank you so much for watching a video of mine but if you're a returning subscriber you know my day ones thank you so much for watching another video of mine so today I'm doing a little DIY I was scoping and looking for a backdrop and 3k is something your girl doesn't have to spend on a backdrop so I went onto Pinterest and I searched some DIY backdrops and this is what I found I'm currently using it right now with uh, a sheet as a backdrop so I'm just gonna show you how I assembled the pieces that I got I got my pieces from Builders Warehouse I basically got a PVC file pipe a PVC pipe and I asked that they cut it into the different sizes that I wanted I'll leave all of that on the video as I talk you through um, the assembling part of it and literally it cost me just under 300 rand and yeah it was like a save a bargain and you know your girls love budget things so if you're interested to see how I assembled the backdrop please do continue watching and give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed the video Okay, so basically guys, I went to Builders and I bought um, PVC pipes, I think I bought like two and then I asked um, the guys there, if you ask them nicely, they'll cut it for you into the different sizes. I'll leave on this video the sizes that um, each of them are, but it's basically two of these long ones, um, four of the medium ones and four of the really small ones. I got four of the tees they look like this and then I got two of these the elbows or a bend and all together it didn't cost more than 300 rand and I'll just show you guys how to put it together so I'm gonna start with these two and I'm gonna take one tee and connect it to the one end of the small one and then take another small one just connect it like that wait like this actually not sure okay. so I'm going to connect this like that and then the other two do the exact same thing connect it to the one end so that we have two like this I'm going to take a medium one, the medium one, and I'm going to connect it to this like this, to form like a T, put that aside, do the same with this one, and then we're going to take another T and put it this way, so it must be facing it would be face, it should be facing the other T on the other side. So just to make sure that it's straight, just move it around. Take the other T so that it also faces it like this. Just make sure it's straight. And then we're gonna take the really long ones and basically connect it like this. Now we have the first half of our backdrop done and we're going to go back and take 
another medium pipe and connect it to the T oops like that and my other one connect it okay I think it's not straight connect it here like this okay then we're gonna take our elbows and connect it to the top. We're gonna take the other elbow, the second elbow, and connect it to the top, also making sure that it's facing that one. Then we're gonna take our last small one, and basically connect to the top. have a dance of backdrop and then you can buy your backdrop papers and put it on. I'm just going to use a white sheet and guys that's the video that is what it is here's my backdrop you understand now within different situations if obviously you wanted a like color you could go and buy a piece of material different color or patterns and use that as your backdrop or the rolling paper you can get on like broadcast lighting for I think it's like 300 rand but um, this is what I could do with and you know, on a budget so yeah, if you enjoyed this video please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to watch the rest of my videos don't forget to like comment subscribe and if you want to be part of the Lib gang click that subscribe button